This is the 4th Street grade crossing located on the UP Geneva sub in Malta, Illinois. Here we have two older safe train signals, each with LED lights and with one e-bell. This is no real looking north. We'll get a look here at the southern signal. Got a GS Type 3 e-bell up top. This replaced the safe train mechanical bell in the last few years. <clears throat> that was the last mechanical bell on this line. As far as I know, at least besides the pedestrian crossing in Chicago. Got 12 by 24 inch GE dot LEDs and older safe train frames. Here's the dot tag. Dot number is 175049T. Got a single sided safe train base. Side view the lights with a safe train bracket. Got an old safe train gate mechanism here. Back view of the lights, the GE dot LEDs replaced Electrotex LEDs in the last few years. Gate has the newer striping with 4 inch Rico LEDs. <clears throat> Here's a back view of the southern signal. There's a relay case in the southeast quadrant. Great here is all concrete track you facing west at the other two crossings in town and towards Creston, uh, Rochelle, and Clinton, Iowa. And track you facing east towards DeKalb, Elburn, and Chicago. So see, these appear to be 80s safe trans signals here. Um, like I said, this had a safe train mechanical bell a few years ago and that got replaced by the GS Type 3 up top there. There's two GS Type 3s in Malta, the other one being down at 2nd Street, down there. Um, so a lot of marginal upgrades to these signals over the years, but unfortunately these signals are going to be replaced pretty soon here, along with the other two crossings in town. New conduit everywhere. This is one of the last of the old relay cases, not bungalows, that <clears throat> is on the Geneva sub. So it's weird to see the signal get so up these signals get so upgraded over the years and then all of a sudden all gone. You know this and second street both got GE dot LEDs and third street still has Electrotex LEDs. Wonder why they replaced the LEDs at those two. It makes no sense. Oh well. There's nobody now looking south. Get a look here at the northern signal. <coughs> These both still have the older track signs too, though newer cross double-sided cross bucks. Got more 24-inch GE dot LEDs and older Satran frames. There's the dot tag again. Got another single-sided Satran base. Side view the lights with a Satran bracket. Another old Satran gate mechanism. Back view of the lights. This gate also has a newer striping with 4 inch Rico LEDs. That's another thing that's going to is the 4 inch Rico LEDs. Even though UP's put a lot of them on this line in the last 10 years, uh, they're pretty much all getting replaced by the NEG clear LEDs, so you won't see them for much longer. You'll see all the new conduit around there. Hey, there's a the back view of the northern signal. <clears throat> so I don't know how much longer these signals are going to last. That remains to be seen, but UP just installed the new signals at Pritchard Road in Maple Park today, I think. The old signals were on the ground, and the new signals were in and active, so probably not going to be long for these signals. Just got to get the new bungalows here and the new signals, and I imagine it'll be pretty soon. So, this has been the 4th Street Railroad Crossing.